Welcome to Lexio Divina Reflections, Memorial of Our Lady of the Rosary, a reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Turning to the disciples in private, Jesus said, Blessed are the eyes that see what you see. For I say to you, many prophets and kings desired to see what you see, but did not see it, and to hear what you hear, but did not hear it. In today's Gospel, as the seventy-two disciples return from their mission, Jesus hears of their victories for body and soul over the powers of darkness. The disciples say to Jesus, Lord, even the demons are subject to us because of your name. Jesus replies, I have observed Satan fall like lightning from the sky. And he tells them that he has given them power so that the full force of the enemy will not harm them. Jesus rejoices in the Father in this and praises his will. In Jesus' name and in the revelation of his divine identity, the disciples accomplished through childlike faith the Father's work which has written their names in heaven. God, you offer me continually the opportunity to see your will accomplished through childlike faith and trust. Help me see the daily battle that rages on. Because of his holy name, Jesus, your son, sees Satan falling like lightning from the sky. And he says to the disciples and to me, Behold, I have given you the power to tread upon serpents and scorpions and upon the full force of the enemy, and nothing will harm you. Through the intercession of Our Lady of the Rosary, Help lift me up today to hear these words when I am in most need of hearing them. Give me the grace, Lord, to return to you again and again for the strength and mercy only you can give me. From the first reading, as your hearts have been disposed to stray from God, turn now ten times the more to seek him. For he who has brought disaster upon you will, in saving you, bring you back enduring joy. Our Lady of the Rosary, pray for me to hear and do whatever Jesus tells me. Take me in hand and show me the way to Christ your Son. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without.